tough team to come back against when they get a lead. Yeah, I think, uh, I mean, it was obviously a super close game, but um, I think we maybe could have come out a little better at the start there. And, um, you know, they're an opportunistic team with some speedy forwards that can vary. So it's a, it's a close one, but you know, we got to come out with a better start. Yeah, I felt all right. I think uh, I'll get better here as we go. I know I know I got better and um, a little disappointed on that first goal and it happened so fast with a guy coming across and probably should have picked up his stick. But um, yeah, like I said, I'll get better as we go here. It's all about playing a patient game when you're playing a team like that. Yeah, and then once you get down, you, you can't really force the issue because they got so many good forwards that just capitalize on your mistakes. So um, yeah, I think you, you phrased it perfectly there. You got to try to get the lead and, and just kind of play a lockdown game from there. Do you feel like when they got it, it's you know, having that they kind of lost <clears throat> Oh, yeah, and they got a good goalie, so it's, it's tough to generate stuff. And our forwards were trying to battle to get to the net there, and we had some good chances that just didn't quite go in tonight. So um, just got to keep at it. But, yeah, Mark Jim's a, he's a good goalie. So uh, A little bit inconsistent. Um, I think for stretches of the game, we we play the right way and kind of get in on the forecheck and, and play that way. And then... Um, I mean, it seems like when we when we get down a couple goals, we kind of change our game, which um, isn't a recipe for success in this league. I think we just got to keep doing the the right things over and over again, even when it's when it's two nothing. And um, I got full confidence and belief that we're going to get there eventually. And um, it's a good learning experience for our team here this early in the season. Do you pay any attention to goal posts that are? <laughs> I think there were maybe four tonight. No, I don't really track those. But I mean, I definitely th thought uh, their goalie played well, but. Um, I think as collectively as a as a forward, uh, we got to get there, uh, make it harder for him. I thought he saw a lot of pucks, but uh, we got to make it harder for them to, to take the eyes away and get more traffic. And um, I mean, overall, I thought it was an even game. They just got plays on on some of their chances, and then um, you know made the most of their opportunities. Did you feel like five on five? You did a good job. Uh, I don't know. I have to go back and watch the game. I guess I don't. Know. I, t I think I think we definitely had our looks. I thought. Um, I thought early on we, we, we came out real in the, with the right frame of mind and um, thought we dictated the play. And then um, obviously unfortunate to, for them to get the first goal. But, you know, I think, um, you know, when they score, we can't really, we can't change our game. And, and, and um, you know, we, I think we know as a team collectively what makes us successful. And it's just a matter of doing that for a full 60 minutes here. Defensively, or trying to force things offensively. Yeah, I think a little bit of both. I think um, instead of just putting it in behind them and going to work, I think we we try and make that extra play east west, and that's when they knock stuff down and go the other way. And um, I think we're going to get there. It's just a matter of of, of doing it uh, like we did against LA. I thought that was probably our best game of putting it deep, putting it in deep, and going to work. And um, like I said, when they, when they score, we can't change our game and, and try and make those little plays east west and. Um, that's when uh, um, you know a team like that, that's super, super skilled, will will uh, you know come come and, come and hurt you. How would you uh, assess your team's game here tonight? Close. No, I, it was a tight game. Uh, luck help. Yeah, but I think you create your own puck luck. I thought uh, both teams played pretty well. Uh, I thought. We had a lot of the game that I liked, but I thought there was a few moments where it got away. We got away from our game, and they stuck with their game a little longer. Uh, there's always momentum back and forth where one team's going to create some chances, one aren't. You know, one team's not. But just you know, it's a fine line between winning and losing in the league, especially when you're playing. You know, two good teams are playing. Uh, two good team. Two teams are on top of their game. You could tell both teams were playing pretty good game tonight. Uh, they lost last game. You knew we were going to get a good effort out of them. Uh, we pushed our, you know, we wanted our team to follow up with another good effort from the other night. And, uh, you know, we came on just up a little bit short. What were some of those moments that you mentioned you want back? Yeah, it's just a little battle here and there. Like sometimes it's the difference between a puck getting over the line out of your zone or just even a little face off edge battle, uh, a little detail here and there, uh, not getting frustrated in your game and sticking with your game. And we're also trying to define our game. And, you know, I think we're getting there. Uh, both teams play fast. You know, it was a fast skating game. Uh, there wasn't a lot of room to move out there for either team. I thought both goalies played well. We hit a few posts. 
it was it was it was a close game. I'd like to have seen our power play be a little bit a little bit better, give us some momentum. I think after the second period they had ten special team shots. We didn't have any. Um, yeah. You said this morning like you want to manage the puck better. Do you think yeah. five on five you did a pretty good job? Yeah, we managed it pretty well. I mean they, they play good defense, they check well. We we're they've got some offensive players that you have to be aware of. Uh, you know, when you get down to two nothing, three nothing, you, you you might open up a little bit. You have to, but for the main part, I thought our puck management wasn't an issue for our, our team at all. You talked a bit about your fourth line. I think they got about eleven shots on goal. But They're great they... tonight. Yeah, I mean, when we went just went through all our players, uh, you know, you can you can give a player a check mark, uh, an E for an even night or an X, and uh, you know. They they all had check marks tonight. They played well. That was, you know, they played to their capabilities. I was happy with their game. It's part of the learning process as we go here. Um, when maybe the offense isn't there right away early in the game, is maybe not falling into old habits. Or yeah, uh, exactly. I think if, you know that that was a great first period. If if you're a hockey person and you watch the game, it was tight. It was you had to work for everything you got. Their top guys weren't getting a lot done. Our guys weren't getting a lot done. And, and a lot of NHL games go that way. And maybe you wait for a power play and you strike then. Uh, you know, they get one at the end of the power play. They get the shorthanded goal, which I thought was a big goal in a tight checking game. And uh, there's going to be a lot of nights where you, you kind of got to earn everything you get. And uh, it's not going to be freewheeling. Uh, good teams don't play freewheeling hockey. And. Uh, you know, you learn when you win. You learn when you lose games that you don't play well. You learn when you lose games that you have a pretty good game and you still lose. And you got to find a way. Good teams find a way to win those games.